Our soil provides key ecosystem services, enabling life on Earth. However, soil degradation prevents our soil from providing such services and negatively affects the livelihoods of millions of people. Recently, a commitment was made to achieve sustainable development by 2030 through the Sustainable Development Goals. 17 goals with 169 associated targets which are integrated and indivisible. Of the 17 goals, four contain targets specifically related to soils. The goals of SDG 2 are to end hunger, achieve food security and improved nutrition, and promote sustainable agriculture. Target 2.4 demands that we must produce food sustainably and use agricultural practices that improve land and soil quality. This means that wherever possible, practices such as farming following the direction of the slope, which can cause soil erosion, should be substituted with sustainable practices like terracing or the construction of grass strips across the slope, following the elevation contour lines of the land. SDG 3 aims to ensure healthy lives and promote well-being for all at all ages. Part of the goal of Target 3.9 is to reduce the number of deaths from soil pollution and contamination. Therefore, practices such as irresponsible mining which results in all three types of contamination, must be counterbalanced by measures such as wastewater management and dust control. SDG 12 moves to ensure sustainable consumption and production patterns. Through target 12.4, it aims to achieve sustainable chemical management and waste disposal. The irresponsible release of pollutants in the environment by anyone can lead to soil contamination. So efforts should be made to educate society and to raise the public's awareness of the impacts of their actions on soil health. Finally, a large part of SDG 15 demands that we halt and reverse land degradation and put an end to biodiversity loss. Part of Target 15.3 specifically states the need to restore our degraded land and soil. One of the causes of soil degradation is the overuse of agricultural inputs. Instead, we should maintain and increase the organic matter content of the soil by promoting crop rotation and diversification. Achieving sustainable management of soil resources will generate large benefits for all. In some contexts, it will be a driver for economic prosperity, and in others, for ensuring the provision of ecosystem services that enable life on Earth.